Come on, well, it's a big trip here. So, um, we're off to Childers, and I'll tell you why along the way. So, roll the intro. Hi, Infy Trev here, and welcome to my channel. Um, hope you get something out of it. Make sure I look pretty. Okay, morning worlds. So I'm off to Childers. Just get out and get going. Make sure I don't run anyone over. Alright, running our worlds, I'm off to Childers. I'm going to pick up some road registration papers for Verge. I've got the phone number of someone I need to ring who can tell me who I need to ring to get the roadworthy sorted for uh, the bike. I'm going to pick up um, new registration um, papers like the um, application. I'm also going to go and pick up some disposal papers. Always good to have a few of them on hand. I'm also going to go and pick up uh, a mic extension lead off the mic extension box. This one's about five miles long. Male one and female the other. And I'm going to go on J-Car over there and see if I can buy a shorter one. I went over there about a year ago or something like that. It was a while ago. And um, they couldn't sell me an extension lead. A short one. And they couldn't even sell me the lead, like the wire or the plugs, to even make up my own extension lead. It just means when I'm getting off and on the bike um, I don't have the hassle of trying to get the lead out of my jacket and so far I can unplug from the mic box make it a lot simpler. But anyway, so more importantly I'm going over to get, get this um, so, more importantly, what I'm doing, I was going over to get the paperwork organised so I can get Verge registered on the road and get riding it legally. So, the backyard's all cleaned up and done. Sorted all my timbers out, that was really good. And Jay, you know I was kidding when I said that shit, mate. You done more good to my house than I could ever have done. The things you've done to improve the house um, are and beyond um, what a tenant normally does. So, yeah. We are so dry down here. We are so dry here at the moment. Two cars in front of me just split left and right. That's cool. So I'm excited to get this paperwork organised. Um, I can't wait to get a roadworthy on Verge done. Whether I can get a sorted for this week or not. Uh, it's only Tuesday today. I'll get home with the paperwork. And I'll ring up and organise, hopefully, maybe this week, getting um, the mobile mechanic out to do the roadworthy on Verge and get it roadworthy. It's only Tuesday today. If he can get out here tomorrow, Wednesday, I can get it registered by Thursday. I'm riding all weekend. That'll be wonderful. So, that's the plan for the moment everything one step at a time. Go and get the uh, paperwork that I need from uh, Children's Courthouse, which is basically just an extension of um, Queensland Roads. And then, of course, um, try and get a lead from J-Car.
phenomenal. me pretty quick was it looks like it's um Brian two doors down the electrician I know I recognize his red Commodore and there's no 80 sign anymore it's straight to 100 so Brian's in a hurry overtake me on double lines yeah, you're definitely in a hurry Brian or Barry whatever his fucking name is he's in a hurry be my bunny. It's always good to have a bunny. Someone up front who's travelling a bit over the speed limit, which means they're in front and travelling quicker, they're the one to get nabbed before you do. That's the theory behind it. Which means I can travel a bit quicker because he's travelling quicker. So I'm sure we find a parking spot down near J-Car somewhere. Or directly opposite the courthouse would be good. Yeah, come on, mate. Oh shit, there's a whole line of them coming through. Was just busy this morning. Looks like I might have a hard time trying to get a parking spot. This is the busiest I've seen Childers in a long time.
American cars like that be left on the road? No bumpers, shit hanging off them everywhere. Yep, yeah, not a parking spot to be found. Oh, that guy scored one. Four wheel drive taking up two parking parking spots. And I've just scored one. Perfect. Right opposite the courthouse. Radio. Radio anyway, Worlds, I'm just opposite the courthouse and I'll go and get some paperwork. So, oh, that's different. So, I don't need paperwork to register Verge. I've just got to get the uh, robe worthy and show up with that. So, I sort of come over here almost for nothing, but I did get um, no sort of disposal papers. So, when I go to sell Verge, so I didn't know that. So, yeah, I didn't need. Um, Vehicle registration papers to read. I didn't need the um, now. Can I get a park out the front of J car here somewhere? This is more crowded down here than it was up there. It's a park there, but I'm not going to squeeze in there. Here I'll have to do. Radio. Let's go down to J car and see if I can get what I need. Still record. Alright, running out of world, so they didn't have that in a shorter cord. So, out of look. Alright, we need to go home. That's all I need to do here. Oh shit, that bugger. didn't quite work so all right I can go home and start ringing up let's go home. all right so I can go home and start ringing up about getting a robe with sorted next which is remove the sticker off my bike
So we're coming up to my favourite part on my trip home when I come this way. Come through the cutting. I love this part. This is my favourite. This changes my whole day. Come through this cutting. And there off to the left, even though you can't see, is the beautiful Mount Walsh. Behind them pine trees right now. There is Mount Walsh right there. Small mountain I call. There's a white dot which you probably can't see. That's the water tower. I live right next to that water tower in Biggerton. Small mountain I call it. What a beautiful mountain. It just looks absolutely glorious today. This is always my favourite part of the drive home is coming through that cutting and seeing Mount Walsh just open up before me like that. I just love it. Or to think that mountain lives in my backyard. That's just right behind where I live. I love it. Oh, home sweet home. That was a quick trip today, completely drama free. You know what? I'm actually going to start flying my Australian flags upside down as a mark of a country in distress. Because we are literally a country in distress at the moment. No doubt about it all this bullshit going on now they're starting this fucking no jab no entry fucking bullshit our life as we know it has gone to shit people right our worlds home and safe in the driveway um, that was a pretty easy mission today and now I've got to start making some phone calls and work work around work on I can't even speak and now I've got to start making some phone calls and work on getting Verge registered right stay safe keep your knees in the breeze and I'll catch you later peoples bye